If you guys are serious about making millions upon millions of coins, then I would highly encourage you guys to click the link down in my description to sign up for Mutt Exchange. Mutt Exchange has multiple different features like a snipe spotter that shows you a live snipe every single time it goes up on your console. This allows you to make millions upon millions of coins uncapped. What it does pretty much is it shows a snipe like this Jordan Love that just went up on Xbox right now. And I would go ahead on my Xbox and search up Jordan Love for 45,000 coins. I would buy it and then I would sell it for the 59,000 that they say it goes for. And then it shows you your exact amount of profit you would make, which is 7,800 coins. Not only that, but they also have an entire page dedicated to showing you every single set in the game that is profit. If you guys are interested, hit the link down below. Use code Tate for 5% off your monthly subscription. I'm back. Yo, what's good, boys? Mystery packs are back. Look, here's the thing. They're the exact same packs. Most feared, still in them. Red zone, still in them. The only difference, they nerfed the odds of midfields and red fields, which sucks, okay? It sucks because chances are we're not going to be making as many coins, if any coins at all. Who knows? These could be a complete scam, but we got mystery packs back. And if we're going to be complaining, then we need to check our stuff because we were complaining when they weren't there. And if we're complaining that they're back and even though they suck, like, come on, you know what I'm saying, brother? So I don't expect anything crazy from here. As you can see, midfield packs are different odds wise. It looks like maybe 381 pluses. I'm not too sure. Red zones are also different. I think there's like seven cards in red zone packs. So it's not a 85 and 283s anymore. Um, so keep that in mind. All right. Like I said, most feared packs are still in here. Nonetheless, Less, we are so happy that mystery packs are back right we are so so happy that mystery packs are back it, it, it provides a little bit of color in life again i can taste my food i'm not even constipated anymore i had to poop the moment i saw that these were out it was amazing um anyways boys hit that like button hit that subscribe button guys follow the discord down in the description okay the discord man that's where like everything is you guys gotta follow the dang discord okay get in there all right get in there you guys can talk all the time and stuff link is down in the description for that okay it's completely free it's all free everything's free but anyways guys i'm hype man i'm freaking hype okay like i said man i'm not too worried about like losing coins opening mystery packs okay it is what it is i'm gonna be 100 honest okay but the fact that they're back in the game the fact that we have a chance now to open packs and the fact that like you know we can still hit big it's not like it's you know impossible to hit big or something i want to pull one of these red zone packs just to kind of see what's in them but hey they're they're back in the game right we got mystery packs back so the content dropped about an hour late literally an hour late guys but uh you know it is what it is uh with it being an hour late at least it finally did drop haven't pulled a card over an 84 yet but i have a feeling that's going to change with the first either red zone or pro ace that we have back also uh a news that a lot of people might be asking as well uh coin cards platinums are still in the game right so every single platinum i believe is still in the game so you can still get up to a 90 platinum something like that you pull it out of a pro ace fantasy pack you're up big you know what i'm saying you pull it out of a red zone pack you're up big all right so keep that in mind um as you guys you know open these packs and stuff like that they can still hit big okay and we know that those are still in the game because people were pulling them out of the ace fantasy pack um yesterday and stuff like that right so um unless they removed them in one day anyways these midfield packs used to be very, very solid, okay? But I'm not going to lie. These new ones don't seem very good. So it's clearly 281 pluses. So 281 pluses and 370 pluses right here. So still potential. 281 pluses, still potential, but not great. Red zone pack. All right, this is the one. Everyone hold your breath, okay? I believe, if I'm not mistaken, seven cards in here, okay? Come on. Show me what they are. I, I, I don't want to pull minimums here. That's not bad at all. I don't want to pull minimums here, but I'm not going to be mad if we do okay so okay 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 i want to say that you are guaranteed four it might be 481 pluses with like an 83 plus right 381 plus 83 i don't know but if that's the case this is not a bad pack at all like this is solid right here especially considering training's really cheap that's pretty freaking solid if i do say so myself guys so you know as much as you want to like as much as we want to be a little like little girl sometimes and like complain about this it's really not that bad okay and, and of course these midfield packs can still pop i mean this is a solid pack right there the majority of our training back and an 83 like that's a really solid pack right there so are these going to be making you coins we haven't opened enough to know and, and chances are i'm gonna say probably no right probably no but i will tell you this much boys they are fun okay they are going to provide us quite a bit of entertainment and uh we can't complain about that all right so okay this seems like a very normal pack so it looks like as we know you, you can still only pull our full four elites so we pull a coin card right here beautiful okay 
pull an 81 beautiful so it does look like it might be 283 pluses 283 pluses and 281 or in an 81 plus or something like that or 281 pluses i don't know but if that's the case that's not bad i would say an 83 plus is very solid honestly like that is a very solid pack the only question is like are these going to be plusing like they used to right where we pull like 88s from them and stuff like that and honestly we don't know we just honestly don't know there we go all right so there we go we pulled another minimum all right this is this is i believe a bare minimum pack this has to be a bare minimum pack 281 plus is an 82 plus and 83 plus i don't know man it's kind of hard to figure it out when these cards aren't in the or packs aren't in the store and i can't just like look them up like that but hey nonetheless if it's an 82 plus and an 83 plus it is what it is right you can still if you pull a coin card you're still up freaking phenomenally but and you have a chance to pull something hu super huge you know even if it's an 83 plus coin card like that's amazing right so keep that in mind as well man we'd like to we like the packs where it's like guaranteed elites right and then if those if in those elites you pull a coin card then you know it's something big all right we have pulled a decent amount of these red zone packs i'm not gonna lie 86 Jermaine pratt okay Jermaine pratt awesome 88 k von thibodeau awesome 84 drew Brees. 81 earl thomas wow an all elite pack brother say what you want chat say what you want can i be this guy i'm gonna be this guy i think these packs are better i think the fact that we get seven cards in those packs is better than a pack that we get four cards in i'm not gonna cap i'm genuinely not gonna cap here guys i think that these packs are better I, I might be tripping i might be i might be high on pot news i might be overwhelmed by the emotions i'm feeling because mystery packs are back but i think it's better if we have seven chances at something nice and huge that's amazing right like i'm i might be tripping guys okay but i don't think i am all right let me know down in the comments what you guys think of these packs i think they're bloody phenomenal okay and, and by bloody phenomenal like i said i don't mean you're gonna make a ton of coins it's possible yes right like right now i feel like i'm making a decent amount of my coins back here but I, all i'm saying is like dude th the fact that we can open these and like even get like the majority of our training back or like whatever it is like that's not terrible at all all right that was a pretty bad red zone pack not gonna cap that was that was pretty freaking bad to be honest guys but it is what it freaking is oh shoot guys i haven't even checked my stocks for the day oh my goodness guys am i rich now no i'm still not rich i'm losing money beautiful that's amazing isn't it it's amazing when you invest you make money or lose money doing absolutely nothing but then again hey scary money don't make money you know what i'm saying boy oh yeah midfield pack let's go we we got to see something pop in a midfield pack whoa all righty boom we'll take that that's a 30k card right there we'll definitely put in the sets now according to sets or back to sets like me saying brother you need to still be doing sets with these cards okay i, I was in uh two Flocka's stream this morning and we were talking about mystery packs he's like i don't see how anyone likes mystery packs these packs are terrible like the, the mystery packs are terrible and that's because he's just like you open them and then you quick sell everything and only sell the expensive cards you can't be doing that you got to use the cards that are fairly cheap and build up to the good cards you know you guys if you've been in my streams you watch my videos you guys would know right and these we're going to be doing the same filter or same sorry same sets that we've been doing the last couple of weeks that these packs have been out we're building up to 90 overall team builders that's the that's the name of the game right there that's another pretty bad pack i'm not gonna lie that's tough pretty bad pack but nonetheless we saw one pop we know it's possible to pop and uh we're not gonna get too in over our heads here i'm not i'm not gonna be saying that these are insane but i'm not gonna be saying these are terrible at all okay you have to see a pro ace fantasy pack i would have loved for them to you know bring back the equal chance that would have been amazing even if they boosted odds or, or sorry boosted how much it goes for i would have loved to see equal chance you know you have the equal chance of pulling an ace pro ace fantasy pack as you do another card you know what i'm saying like that would have been really really nice very solid pack right here very solid pack that's that's training profit and coin profit on that pack we will definitely take that solid pack right there midfields they have a little bit of value right a little bit of value you can you can pull some good stuff in there it's much better than the last midfield pack that's for sure they definitely increased the odds on those since uh like two times ago or whatever you know what i mean so we'll take those those aren't terrible at all man we we do we do the the theoretically enjoy those red zone pack i pulled a lot of red zone packs have i not i pulled quite a few red zone packs 84 okay 81 84 81 79 76 81 not terrible we'll take it we'll take it we'll take it we'll take it that's training profit on that pack right there we will take it a trading profit pack is an, is is a solid pack right and keep in mind i'm only quick selling stuff i'm not going to be putting into sets you guys see me keeping 83s 85s 88s 86s stuff like that that's because i'm putting into a set right so that's that's why i'm keeping those um still though we haven't pulled like pulled 188 
we haven't pulled like a, a 90 plus or anything like that not that like not that we were pulling 90 pluses at an insane rate earlier right but like i would like to see a 90 plus just to know that it's still very much so possible i'd also like to see a couple more 88s right like we've pulled two 88s or something so far i would like to see a few more 88s here um maybe an 89 or something like that just to show like that you know hey we're still in packs we're still we're still yeah we're still in packs and we're still you know able to give you a boom pull you know what i mean i would like that but hey once again beggars can't be choosers we got what we asked for we got mystery packs back and if we're really going to be sitting here and complaining hey maybe we maybe we don't deserve nice things i don't know right like that's just that's just kind of the way it goes 70 plus right here not great but hey not gonna lie dude the 70 pluses can pop we've pulled some good stuff from 70 pluses i pulled plenty of 89s from 70 pluses i've seen plenty of 90s pulled from 70 pluses now the question is right what packs better to open the 83 plus zero chill or you know for half the price pretty much you open a mystery pack right the mystery pack on one hand you know it could be a 70 plus it could be a bad midfield pack it could be a bad most fear pack right or if you pull a red zone pack you are guaranteed to make back more coins than the 83 plus pack right and this 83 plus pack is twice as much almost twice as much as the mystery pack so in that sense it it would seem that the mystery pack is the smarter pack to open because you get more cards more chances to make coins whereas the the, the 83 plus you're kind of banking on just pulling something you know really really good from uh from those packs is this gonna be another all elite pack it is wow another all elite pack right here which honestly these are kind of reminding me of uh playmaker packs right is that is that what they're called were they no pro well playmakers last year but rushing packs right they're kind of reminding me of rushing packs a little bit which isn't a bad thing um rushing packs you get a lot of different cards in them so you know you have a lot of different chances to hit big and a lot of different chances at coin cards and a lot of different uh you know cards that you can put into sets or sell or quick sell so you know it's not terrible that's for dang sure definitely not terrible now guys just hey i'm not trying to be that guy that just promotes out here if you guys are wondering how i'm making so many coins it's all mud exchange all right link is down in the description for that i know some of you guys hate them but guys i'm telling you they are legit okay boys use code tate it'll uh, save you quite a bit of money i know you saw that intro i know you saw that promo in the intro brother hey hey I, I, i'm well tuned on promos i've been doing social media now for a while boys you should see some of my tiktok promos my boy i once did a tiktok promo for a uh for freaking it was um you know like grammarly where it reads through and it like corrects your stuff right corrects your grammar mistakes in like a paper you wrote for school or something like that i once did a promo for a company like that it was a knockoff company of grammarly but dog i'm telling you okay i i am well tuned when it comes to uh when it comes to doing promos my boy i don't know why i said that or why you need to know it but i said it and now you know it like that's just the way it goes give me another red zone pack i want i want one more red zone pack and i want one pro ace fantasy pack one pro ace fantasy pack would feed families okay 87 i like it 87 we'll take it that goes into uh well actually we're probably just gonna sell that for like 25k make our coins back on the pack but that's like a coin backpack plus a uh, couple of you know a little bit of quick sell so that's a little bit of a w a little bit of a little bit of a w there all right 81 come on show me something huge here show me something mega mega ladong mega ladong mega ladong 85 we'll take it not great not great but not terrible we'll take it man yeah i don't know I don't know i'm not like i'm not like I'm, we're not seeing the pluses that's for dang sure we're not seeing the pluses that we used to from red zone packs okay but we are also you know getting way more packs and once again they're back so i gotta keep reminding myself that like as much as like oh i missed the old red zone packs like hey hey they're in the game you can still pull red zone packs and if you pull a red zone pack it's pretty much guaranteed money back so that's always solid midfield 281 is not great not great at all but it is what it is man it really it is what it is i would really be curious to know what you guys think down below okay i'm a little more like i'm a little more just happy that they're back you know what i mean because it one it gives me content for streaming but two it's like it gives me content for videos right this is all about content here so i get a lot of content right which is beautiful and maybe maybe what i gotta do is i gotta open up a ton of these right and get like all the red zone packs and then maybe i do a, a like a solo video on me opening like 50 red zone packs just to see what we be getting out of them right just to see kind of a good sample size of okay we opened 50 red zone packs 
you know, was it decent? Was it bad? How was it, right? An 86 right there. We'll take it. Pulled quite a few 86s too. That's not bad. Man, we've opened a lot of packs though. Like we've been able to open a lot of these packs with quick selling a lot of stuff, right? When you quick sell a lot of different stuff and only keep the cards that you put into sets, hey, we're able to open quite a few packs here. Way more than I would have thought I would have been able to open, right? I think I've probably easily opened 60 plus packs. No shot I haven't, right? Like Maybe I'm tripping, but no shot I haven't opened at least 50 to 60 packs. We started the stream at like, or we started the video at like 65,000 training or something like that. So, hey, that's always, that's always nice. We got two more packs here, guys. Two more packs remaining. Is it juice? Are we going to pull the juice? That's the question. Are we going to pull another red zone pack? Are we going to pull, there's a coin quick sell. I mean, it's not a great one, but we'll take it. Are we going to pull a pro, pro, pro ace? Show me a little 85 coin card. What are we okay? Red zone ended off on a red zone. What better way to end it off than the way that we should, uh, than, than the pack that we should be hoping for? 83, 82, 75. It's a zero chill. Please be a 90. It's an 83. I got chills down my spine for that card. I'm not gonna cap 81. All right, hey. Low key, that's actually a solid pack. We get two 83s that go into sets and we get a card that's going to be selling for 8K. That's not a terrible if I do say so myself, guys. Hey, let's freaking go. I had a lot of fun. Okay, these packs are back. I'm happy about that. You guys should be happy about that as well. I hope you guys are. If you're not, um, I'm sorry. But like, hey, they're back and that's all we ask for, right? I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have a blessed rest of your guys' day. I'll see you guys all in the next video and peace.